Okay, ready? My name, uh, my name is Rafi Mediavilla. I'm from Criticologos.com. So first up, Vanessa, so I'll thank you for your time. I know you're really busy you. and I'm excited to talk to you and congratulations on the season. It was epic. Thank you. Thank you, Rafi. I want to start talking first to Vanessa and I, you know, single mother, immigrant, having to deal with basically two kids, Johnny and, and Miguel. <laughs> so you, you're raising two kids. That, that's the truth. Yeah. Um, who do you look for inspiration when portraying this character? It's so important. That you want it to make to, for, for it to feel as truthful as possible. Who do you use for inspiration or, or what do you see uh, in, in Vanessa, in the, in oh. the character? That's such a lovely question. Um, basically, all the strong Latina mothers who I grew up around, primarily my own. Uh, my mother was a very get it done person. And, uh, you know, I, I like to say sometimes that this character is like the combination of my own mother and myself, different aspects. Um, and then she's, you know, also her own her own entity. But Yeah, those day to day things, I think I draw a lot of inspiration from that because it's a very, you know, it's a very like the small things you do every day get you forward. So I think she's that type of a character. I want to go now to Solo. Solo, um, I want to point out two pivotal moments on the, on the season. I think the first one is a really high moment and the other one is like kind of a low moment. I think it's really cool when you get, when I mean, you have to put the bandana on, the Miyagi uh, Dojo bandana. I want to talk about Miguel's mindset. What's Miguel's mindset when he got the bandana? What was he was thinking? What he was feeling? I think it was so, so new and fresh to, or refreshing, I should say, to work with, uh, you know, Daniel San in, in those moments, you know, getting drilled, getting thrown into cement mixers and, you know, chased by dogs in junkyards. Sometimes I feel like maybe gets a little bit tiring and, and having the whole wax on wax off, like, you know, almost yoga aspect to, to Miyagi, I think was a little bit more refreshing and then Miguel needed that. Um, but getting to put on that bandana, it's funny. I remember filming that scene and Ralph being like, Hey, it's like, you're like a younger, newer, less handsome LaRusso. It's, <laughs> it's, it's like, you're, it's like, you're almost me. And, and it, it's, you know, funny getting to be in that, in that moment. It feels like he earns it pretty quickly though. I guess. Oh. It's in. Yeah. Um, before I, I let the two of you go, um, how does it feel to be part of pop culture? You're part of pop culture. You're part of, of a franchise that 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 just it, it has been uh, you know it has transcended generation. The two of you, how does it feel? Uh, it's real exciting, amazing. Can't believe it. Also, just you know, uh, you just have to continue doing what you're doing, doing something right. <laughs> so. Yeah. So just keep swimming, right? No, yeah, I'm, I'm super excited. And, and honestly, the, the biggest thing for me is that, you know, this show, be, be getting to act alongside other Latinos like, like Vanessa and, and Rose and everyone else, like it, it doesn't mean anything if, if more doors aren't being opened to, to other Latinos in the business and stuff like that. So that's, that's honestly what I hope. I hope that this it truly is like pop culture and not like Oh, th there's the handful of Latinos on screen. You know? So before I let you go, I gotta ask you because you're gonna kill me. You're gonna be working uh, here in Puerto Rico. Correa is gonna work here. You got a project here. You're gonna be working with Angel Manuel Soto. You're gonna be at Comic Con. How excited are you for all the things that's going on happening in 2020? Oh man, I'm so nervous. You have no clue. <laughs> I, I know I'm sitting here laughing with you, but it's, I, it's exhilarating. It is truly nervous excitement and, and I'm ready for everyone to see it. Perfect. Thank you, Vanessa. Thank you, Solo. Thank you for your time and congratulations on an epic, epic season. And that's going to be, oh my God. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Have a great day, Rafael.